Hello, hello everyone. And we are back one more time and it has been five years since you guys have hear me saying hello, hello and see you next time. I cannot explain how happy I am announcing the community. It has been a long, long ride and you have seen me growing. We have grown together. You saw my first kid birthday. You saw when I moved to London and you have been with me while I had COVID. Now you were with me when we moved here to Vancouver and we are still together. I cannot even explain how happy I am seeing the result, seeing the reaction at the beta test and all of the work that we have put together into this. And it's not just me, it's all the community everyone that has supported the tutorials, the content, the comments made this possible. So I want to show you what we are adding. I want to show you all what the community is about and what we are bringing in. Patreon was starting to get a little bit short for us. We have way too much content and it was starting to get messy. We will keep using patrons. Every patron will get access directly to the community. So there are a hop that will exist around Patreon. So don't worry about that. We have all the automation worked out. Uh, we may have some issues at the start, but believe me that everyone that is on Patreon will have access to their correct tier at the community also. This is Creature Garage. Creature Garage is going to be a hub of Creature Dev. At the moment, we are focusing mostly on Groom, but the long run, we are going to start adding creature dev, modeling, look dev, texturing, and we will try to create the whole environment of what is creature development. The idea is to bring a community to create an stack overflow for CG, as Nicolas said, uh, the character uh, supervisor of Blur, that is with us, is part of the community. And he used that phrase, I love it. That's one, one of the things that we want to bring in. And here it is. You will get access to this community. And the first thing that you will see is the start here. The start here, it's the area where you have the major categories. So we have the fundamentals of Groom, uh, the Houdini tutorials, the action tutorials. Also, we have three more tiers that are not as developed and they will evolve in time. We have 3D concept, Redshift and resources. Resources is where you will find everything that is downloadable at the community. So bear that in mind. A little bit lower, you will discover the community that is the pop. The pop I will explain later on and probably on the next video, but I will just mention it later on. And then you have the top three courses that are the ones that we are recommending at this moment. It's Houdini Fox Groom, Action for production and the ponytail haircut groom. Then if you're not a premium member, it's to register, but we will work out how to turn on and off these tiers or these links when you're already a patron or a patron. So once you click a link, you will go to the landing page where you can find all the videos. In this case, we have the groom fundamentals and the feedback rounds. They are the fundamental theories. And once you click play, you can see that this has all the playlists and you can move them around. We have some feedback on moving the playlist around as you cannot track, but we are working around them. And the nice thing is that you can go to the playlist and on the playlist, you will have your videos here. But also once you hit play, you will have the playlist videos also here. And it's a slightly easier that's a nice hello hello up. everyone and welcome Let me to just put a new pause. series and, and it's slightly easier to navigate over here things that you have to be aware of and this is the massive improvement that we did and i'm super excited about this is that now we just have not just a playlist but also you can have uh the quality the same that we have I'm always sorry for me. And once you have that, we have a speed. So we can increase the speed of the videos. That is something that a lot of you have asked on Vimeo, but the price of the Pro wasn't actually adding that much. So I didn't add it on time. And if you notice, we also have subtitles. These subtitles are via AI. So there are some words that you will see 
weirdly enough if you catch them please let us know because we can uh, provide information to the AI to maximize the output of these words. But there is something that I really want to show you all is the search. The search option will give you a transcript of everything that is happening on the video and you can jump to that point in time. And also you can use, for example, any keyword that you would like to search. And in this case, you can just go to the area that you want to see. And this will help us a lot to get the proper information that we need and to make easier because the amount of information that we have is so much that maybe you want to know one specific part on a long video. And this is an easier way just to jump around and to get your information correctly. This is one of the biggest things that we want to start and to get for you all. Also, once you have to move, you can go back and you can go to any of the other series. You will see that we have some images that need some flyers yet. We haven't finished that part, but the implementation will come in time. And here you can see all the series that we have. Action for production, setting Maya for action, introduction to action, groom from zero to groom, uh, the trending, one of the best series that we have is the actions quick tips. This series, it's a Bible of quick tips, information and techniques for the ones that haven't seen it. We also have the grooming Q and a, that is a really important series that answers most of the questions that you guys do, do sorry. And we have that little Q and a, you can ask any question. And if it's easier enough to answer, I will make a small video and put it on the grooming Q and a. We also have the DigiDouble series over here, the new series that we're working right now on Action. We have the Creature series, Animal Fur with Action, that is a great series for starters, doing character creations, hair cell tip, red panda groom, and the resources. So this is part of the easier way that we can see the tutorials now. We have the Houdini tutorials, the quick tips, the creature tutorials, and we are starting to see everything a little bit better. If we go to the 3D models, for example, you will see the resources and the Maya resources path that you have everything to download. We have some typos still that we need to fix and slowly growing into that. If you catch any bug or any detail, just let us know and report it on the community. We will do our best to fix it. This part, some of it is close to high tier patrons. And most of it will send you directly into Patreon to download the assets. Also, the studios will have access to this. So finally, we're able to give the studio access. That is something that it has been a problem for a huge amount of person or more than one person that want to use the same platform. We couldn't do that in uh, Patreon, but we do now. So we can now. Now it's the pop area. The pop area, it's the communication area. And it's the community that we want to build. And it's this, this is Creature Garage. This is the pop. The concept of the pop is based in London BFX community, the pop, the after work, and, and the concept of sharing, caring, and just having a rant or just giving information, networking, everything that you can do to make it better or just to pass for a beer and relax. We have that information here. This is the current state as of today. We have news, we have some Reddit posts, we have the feedback that amazing uh, beta testers have been looking and working for. And you can see that we have a lot of categories over here. These are the categories that will be open for the full tier patrons. If you are a free user, that this part will have free users also you will not see all the categories. So bear in mind that the, the categories are hidden for non high tier patrons or for non patrons or non subscribers. So you can read everything here. There are going to be really, really interesting uh, posts like this one. This one, it's a small Bible of pitch fuss that I found and it's amazing. I haven't posted on Patreon or anywhere else because I want to create one little niche hub of really high tier information also. Here you will find your welcome. And this explains what are we doing? What are what we are 
and all the rules and all the little things and how we are launching the product. You can write a post right on the categories and we have also a roadmap and change log that will show you what's on their plan and what we are working on and how we are digesting the feedback. This community will grow. This project will grow. We're adding chats. We're adding a lot of things based on the third party software that we're using. So please let us know what you think. And if you find something that you will like, give us the feedback. So here you can see some of the feedback that we already received. We're working on it. We're organizing it. And there are some really nice things going on. Also, you can see that we have a lot more categories with pop talk, with your garage, uh, the exit quick tips, the exit Houdini. We are adding ornatrix. We are in creatures. We are in these doubles. It's a new area where you are not going to lose the information as we did before. Most of the information got lost in Patreon, got lost in Facebook, got lost on, on the small chats, even at Discord. So now we will try to implement something that it's easier to search. For example, if I just want to search feathers, this is everything that I have. And also, this is a nice one. We are adding the jobs. Jobs are going to be hidden just for subscribers. And the jobs tabs, it's going to be great. Let me just click it over here and go for groom, for example. And this is going to give us Huh, I didn't knew that. That's an error. So this is going to give us all the jobs that are currently available and that we know of some rare posts and rare positions are going to be highlighted like this one. The groom supervisor for DNIC is a huge, really nice position and it's for Canada. So everything that you will find here is going to be a curated uh, community of content that will give us a place to be that the information will not be lost. Then you can just go back to your courses and you are back into the community. Another nice thing on the courses part is that it will remember where you left and you will be able to see it. Later on, we will implement more things around these where you left. But for now, this is where we are. I hope you like it. And sorry for making this video so long, but I'm really, really excited for it. So thank you so much for supporting this content, for supporting the community and for being part of this. I hope we can make something amazing. And as a little part of something that I started a while ago in Maleficent, we are starting the lore. The lore will be a weekly event that I will write about everything that happens on the community. I started this project in Maleficent too, when we were working at NPC. There was a moment in time that it was really busy and we, we had to cheer up a little bit more. So I started doing these small little funny stories just before the weekly mails and it ended up quite fun. So I evolved that into this new community and let's see where our story evolved as a whole. And some of you will see yourself mention some hints of what's coming and who are we and who is inside. So thank you so much and see you on the next one.